Steering gear. A steering gear is the equipment provided on ships to turn the ship to left port side or to right starboard side while in motion during sailing. The steering gear works only when the ship is in motion and does not work when the ship is stationary. Telemotor system. The telemotor system is a system which transmits a mechanical order by turning the steering wheel to a distant system called the actuating system, which in turn works to turn the rudder by corresponding angle. The telemotor system comprises of transmitter and receiver. Transmitter which move in opposite directions as the steering wheel is turned. The fluid is therefore pumped down one pipeline and drawn in from the other. The pumped fluid passes through piping to the receiver and forces the telemotor cylinder unit to move. The suction of fluid from the opposite cylinder enables this movement to take place. Hilschwa pump. The variable pump assembly, also known as radial cylinder Hilschwa pump, consists of a short shaft, which is attached to a cylindrical body that rotates inside the casing. All the cylinder bodies have pistons inside and are fastened to the slippers by means of gunge and pin. The circular ring, which accommodates the slippers, is concentric with the central valve arrangement. Due to this, no oil is pumped or sucked in and although the pump is rotating no fluid is delivered. As soon as the circular floating ring is pulled to the right the pistons in the cylinder undergo a reciprocating motion. The lower piston moves inwards and discharges fluid through the lower port. The piston moves till the horizontal position and then moves outwards in the opposite direction, drawing in fluid through the upper ports. Thus in this way the top ports act as suction ports and the lower ports act as discharge ports. If the circular ring is pushed to the left direction, the suction and discharge ports are reversed. Haunting gear. The heel shaw pump control spindle is connected to the middle of the floating lever. The top of this lever is connected to the output of the telemotor receiver through a linkage. The bottom of the lever is connected to the tiller arm as a feedback link through a buffer spring. When the receiver output signal pushes the floating lever to port side, Thus pump control spindle will move outside. This would actuate the pump and the pump will start pumping causing the rudder to rotate. When this happens, teller feedback buffer springs start to move towards starboard side. As this happens, control spindle will start coming back inside and pumping action will slowly reduce and stop when control spindle in neutral position. Pumping having stopped would stop the rudder at ordered angle. When the receiver output shift to the normal position, midship, consequently pump control spindle shift to the other direction. Thus the pump is working in the reverse direction. The rudder start rotating in the opposite direction and the buffer spring moves towards normal position, causing control spindle coming back to neutral and the pump will stop at midship position and floating lever would come back its original vertical position. 